Hi everyone, it's Karen from Hey Mamas, and today I thought I would talk about what my 17-month-old toddler eats in a day. I know within my mom's group we're always talking about our baby's eating habits, so I figured I'd go ahead and share what ours is right now. So Layla Jane wakes up very early in the morning, usually around 5, and she usually starts the day off with a smoothie. And Layla Jane is a very picky eater, like, like most toddlers. But the most frustrating thing is she will not eat fruit and vegetables. It is so hard to get her to eat any fruits or veggies. So I have to be sneaky about it. So in her smoothie, I usually make it using chocolate milk, and then I add in some spinach, and then, because that has great iron and vitamins in it, I usually put a banana in it, so there's a fruit that I sneak in there, and then I put in some peanut butter. Usually I use peanut butter powder if I have it. If not, I just use regular peanut butter. And she loves it. She has no idea that there's fruits and veggies in there, and she drinks that up. I usually give it to her while she's kind of waking up still, and she's watching one of her shows and just kind of lounging, and she'll drink all that up. Then about two hours later, I would say, she's ready for a little bit more, so I try to give her some protein. And she loves eggs, so I'll scramble up some eggs. She likes to be a part of the process, so I'm usually holding her while I'm making it. And then I usually just kind of hold her while I feed it to her. And I found that she eats it a lot more easily if I feed it to her like that. For snacks, that just kind of varies on the day and if we're out and about, if we're at home. Sometimes it's these Pure Bars, which she absolutely loves and it has some good fruit concentrate in there for her. I get those at Costco. You can also get them on Amazon, I believe. Um, she also loves these crunchy snap peas. I get them at Trader Joe's, but I've seen them all over the place. She loves um, some animal crackers and goldfish, all of those types of things she'll gobble up. But one thing I always try to give her too are these healthy muffins that I make that once again have some fruits and veggies all hidden in them. I've linked the recipe down in the description below if you want to try it out with your toddlers and see if they like it. But it has in it just some little bit of brown sugar, some applesauce, bananas, carrots, um, a little jar of baby food butternut squash. I sometimes use carrots. If I don't have the butternut squash, I use the uh, baby food carrots, eggs, whole wheat flour, regular flour, bran flakes, a little baking soda, and some pumpkin pie spice. Sometimes if I don't have that, I just use some cinnamon for some good flavoring. And that's it. And they're so easy to make and she loves them. So again, I have to be really sneaky about getting these fruits and veggies in. So right now she is napping and when she wakes up, we'll do our lunch. And it used to usually, it used to be something like peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. She loved them, but she doesn't like them so much anymore. Like a typical toddler, what she likes one day, she does it the next. So I'll have to figure out something different for lunch today, but I have an idea of what I'm gonna do. So let's just wait until she gets up. Well, it's been about an hour and a half, so I know Layla Jane's gonna be waking up soon, so I'm gonna start getting her lunch ready for her. Now, I mentioned earlier that she usually does not eat fruit, and I have to hide them. The one fruit that she will sometimes eat is an apple. So every day, I cut up little bits of apple and give them to her in the hopes that she'll eat more and more each day. So that's one thing I'm gonna get ready for her. Okay, got that done. So now, another thing that I've been doing recently with her, since she's not eating peanut butter and jelly sandwiches anymore, I have been getting her these little peanut butter squeeze packets. She loves these. I will cut the corner off and hand it to her, and she usually just kind of walks around the house, playing with some toys, eating this, and it keeps her busy, it keeps her entertained, and she's eating it, and it's all natural. I love this stuff. So I'll probably give her one of these today, too. Another thing that I love to give her that also has some hidden veggies in it are these veggies made great muffins. You can buy them in the freezer section. I get the double chocolate muffins and it's made with fresh zucchini and carrots in them. She absolutely loves those. So if I don't have some of my homemade muffins made, I'll sometimes give her those too or I'll give them to her as a little dessert at the end of the day because it's chocolate and she loves it. She thinks it's sweet, but there's really veggies in it. And she's up. So I'm first gonna go over and see if she'll eat some apple. Hey, pretty girl, you want some apple? There we go. Good girl. 
She ate a lot of her apple, so now she gets some peanut butter. Oh, come here, Layla. Layla. There you go. It's now about dinner time, and usually for dinner, I just give Layla Jane kind of what we're eating. So we had stuffed peppers with ground turkey and quinoa, and I'm gonna try giving her that and see how she likes it. Right now though, she's having a little appetizer of some crispy snack peas. She loves those, don't ya? Yeah. All right, she likes it, yay! I love it when I find things that she likes. Although I am realistic and know that probably in a couple days she won't like it anymore, but while she does like it, I'm gonna give it to her a lot. <laughs> Cause this is nice and healthy, it has lots of good stuff in it, tomatoes in it, she got veggies. Oh nice, you're liking that. She also loves to feed herself, so anytime I'm giving her something and she's able to hold the fork and feed herself, I let her, cause she'll eat even more if I let her have that opportunity. Well, there you go. That's what we eat in a typical day. Of course, things vary by day, but on average, that's what we do. It's just all about me trying to hide healthy stuff. <laughs> so she eats it. Let me know if you have any good tips or good recipes on things that have veggies and fruit in it that a toddler might not be able to uh, notice and I can sneak it in there and get her to eat it. Thanks again so much for watching. Please make sure to like and subscribe and follow me on Instagram at HeyMamas18. Bye.